My name is Bobby Flay. My mission, to find the best of the best. My objective, perfecting their signature dish. The plan of attack, I'm showing up to challenge them, but they don't know it. I may win, I might even lose. It's anybody's game. It's the ultimate throwdown. Pie. Simple word, big idea. I'm Janet. I'm Allie. And, and we're, we're the Pie Moms. Berry Manor Inn in Rockland, Maine. They look dangerous. <laughs> Claim to fame. Janet and Allie think they make the best pies in the world. Ta-da! The Boston Globe is among the publications that have fallen in love with their pies, including apple, strawberry rhubarb, and a mixed berry pie that features Maine's famous wild blueberries. There's something about those little berries. They're sweet. Yeah. The setup. The Pie Moms think they've been tapped for a Food Network special called Pie a la Road. You're watching Food a la Road. On the Food Network, it's Pie a la oh, Road. Oh, God. <laughs> Your mission, study up on the Pie Moms. They have nearly 100 years of baking experience between them and a whole town behind them. You must deliver a pie with a flaky crust and a perfect berry filling in order to win this throwdown. Cook or be cooked. Welcome to Pie Town. What was I supposed to say? <laughs> All right, Pie Moms, I'm coming to you with my flaky crust. Just don't hit me with your rolling pin, okay? The picturesque town of Rockland, Maine is best known for two things. Lobster and pie. And in Rockland, the two grand dames of pie are Janet and Allie, the pie moms of the Berry Manor Inn. They have now learned to embrace their celebrity. They've had their pictures in the newspapers quite often. Hi, hi. <laughs> Summer is peak pie time in Rockland, which means a busy schedule for Janet and Allie. Hi. On the calendar today, is an appearance at the Lime Rock Inn to judge a pie-eating contest. Welcome, lady. Oh, thank you, sir. To the fairest of pie days. Oh, yes. This is the most pie eaten by Chelsea. <laughs> moms are also the grand marshals at the annual pie raid that takes place on Main Street. Hey Food Network, welcome to Pie Town! It's an event that attracts thousands to celebrate pie and the ladies who make it best. We love pie. But they weren't always such big celebrities. Back in 1998, Janet and Allie's respective children, Mike and Cheryl, recruited their moms to boost business by baking pies for their bed and breakfast, the Berry Manor Inn. Yeah, we've created monsters. But the good news is we've extended their contract for at least 10 more years, so we'll continue to have pies. <laughs> Tomorrow, Janet and Allie will be showcasing their show-stopping treats at a local pie picnic set up by the Food Network. America loves our pies. And you will, too. <laughs> but will this lively twosome be ready to take me on? It's showtime in Pie Town. And Janet and Allie are kicking off their pie picnic. Something went terribly wrong here. It's an afternoon of food and fun with one big surprise. All right, we're in Rockland, Maine, but we're going to roll up with our peach and blackberry pie. And I'm going to great aunt butter. Because I like butter. That high. <laughs> I use just a half a cup of shortening.
Yeah, well, I'll, I'll definitely put a pie hat, hat on later. Okay, you're going to put one on now. Yeah, come on! Anyway, I'm here for a particular reason. Because I heard that you guys, the pie moms, are the best pie makers in New England. Absolutely. That's true. <laughs> and so, I'm here to challenge you to a pie throwdown. What do you say? <laughs> okay. Oh, we're going to outdo him, no doubt about it. We've had years of experience. We no, just I had it right here. It was bench flour. Yeah. It was right here. Here, use it. Yeah. We'll use it all up. Yeah. <laughs> Who took the flour? <laughs> Somebody took the flour. Oh, you took it. No, no, Allie took it. <laughs> you, were you over here? I didn't even see you. All right. I needed flour. It's been one hit after the next with these two. He didn't even know we had his flour. And it's about to get even uglier. No, 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 that's too thin. <laughs> I'd be a little ashamed of that. It's like good cop and bad cop over here. The pie moms have me so off my game that I've forgotten how to roll a crust. Wait, that's not round. It's cracking. We're making square pies today. Luckily, Janet is a good sport, and she jumps in to lend me a hand with her plastic wrap technique. And you can put it wherever you want it. Like that? Well. <laughs> After I brush my pie with cream and sprinkle it with brown sugar, Allie offers to cut the vent holes. Then it's off to the oven. Beautiful. With the judges' pies in the oven, it's time to feed the crowd. We baked a bunch earlier this morning, so now we just need to slice and serve. I'm eating Bobby's pie, just baked, very warm, and very delicious. The mom's pies were kind of like my grandma made, a real sweet, wonderful, fruity pie. Oh, uh, what's that? A good pie, blueberry. And this is mixed berry? I'd have to give the edge to Bobby. Just... I totally disagree. Very How is it? Delicious. Would you get up in the night to eat it? Absolutely. That's the truth. Yeah. What's so hard about that? <laughs> and now it's time for the pie moms to try mine. What am I eating, Bobby? White and yellow peaches, blackberries, the filling. And then the, the crust has a, a brown sugar crust on top of it. Mm. Your filling is very good. I wouldn't get up in the night to eat it, but... <laughs> After these two, dealing with the judges is going to be a piece of cake. I mean, the pie. winner is. Pie A. My, my mother's going to kill me now. We feel fine. Yeah. The guests always say ours is good. I know. Everyone that I talk to likes ours. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I just want to uh, thank everybody, um, especially the people from the historic ends of, of Rockland, Maine. Uh, everybody's been so, so nice to me, even now. I didn't think that Bobby Flay would have the um, background or the cooking experience to bake a homemade pie. The liquid that goes with berries in a pie like that should hold together more. Right. I don't know what happened with this particular pie that they presented to the judges because the pies that we tried were not running. We gotta give it up for the pie moms because you guys were obviously yeah. okay. This pie was good. I will say that. Well, um, I liked ours much better. His wasn't yeah. sweet enough, but we had a good time yeah. with it. So to all you awesome cooks out there, keep doing what you do, but ask yourself this. Are you ready for a pronoun? <laughs> Oh, yeah.